What's up there guys, this is Cobb and welcome to another episode of Bloody Iron Man Leveling. Cobb's death sent us a little bit of mail. Let's, let's read that. See what he's got to say for himself. You'll die before level 70. Well, he's a man of few words. Cobb's death, don't judge him. Up we go. Um, they want me to go and warn people. I guess I'll just go and do some easy random turnings. I might just grind. I might just grind, get some music on, maybe go to like the Deadmire or something, and just kill like a billion mobs. Um, that might be what we do here. Because <laughs> honestly, it's getting to the point where the quests are like really fucking difficult. Um, look at that, man. We've got a bunch of fucking orange quests. Why? Because we skipped Hellfire, man. I came here at level 60 thinking I'd be high enough for Zangamash. Man, we're a little low, you know. We're a little bit low. Go back to someone at the Scenarian Refuge. Go back to someone at the Scenarian Refuge. Okay. Alright, warned them. They told me to come back to you. And that you'd give me some more XP. Man, every time I say that I'm gonna go and grind. Like, I'm just gonna grind for an hour. I grind for like 10 minutes. And get all depressed. And I go wandering off looking for quests to do, you know. But I mean, come on now. I, I really mean it this time. Alright? I really mean it this time. I've got some redemption to do, man. I just recorded an episode of Dark Souls 2. I didn't even make it to a boss. Man, the DLC stuff is fucking hard. Like, we only died, what, once or twice in it, I think? But still, like, oh my god, I was having to play this so carefully. Alright, man, I'll tell you what it is. I've been here fucking farming this little area. For, like, what, 35 minutes or something? And I've gotten 10% of a ding. Or maybe it's only been, like, half an hour. I don't bloody know, man. I can't be working at 10% a ding in half an hour. That ain't just gonna, it's just not gonna happen, is it? It's not gonna happen. So I'm gonna go and do one of the only quests that's yellow on our list. Fuck. <gasps> kill him quickly, kill him quickly! Someone who sent it still, fuck that dude. Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that man. Someone just fucking ended still. Was he after me? Was he after me? You know what it is? The fact that I don't fucking see him anymore tells me that he's on the ground and he doesn't. He thinks that my spider on didn't ping up in time. Possibly. Possibly. Man, I know it's like probably partially paranoia, but every fucking ally that I see, dude, I just assume that they're after me, you know? <laughs> what if they get me? And all that shit. No, but legit though, it detected him in stealth for fuck's sake. Like, are you kidding me? He didn't just go past on like a flying mount or something. You know what else is shady as fuck? After flying all over the entire place, um, Spyron pinged and told me that he was in Feralfen Village, which is where we are right now, but there's not a single other dead mob. That tells me that he wasn't questing here. Tells me that he dropped off a fucking flying mount and ended stealth. That's what that tells me, man. That's what that tells me. I don't like it. I don't like this, man. This smells fucking... This smells off, man. This smells rank, you know? Something about this man ain't right. Alright, we're back for another day. Whole new day, rather. New jacket, new shirt, new day. I got fucking spooked as hell. Last time we played. So I decided to just like call it quits. Oh, okay, booty bears into attack. I'm still fucking nervous as hell around here, man. That rogue showing up last night. Ugh. Something felt really the icky about that man I didn't like that shit one bit oh my god man this bloody mob is a pain in the ass dude look at him oh why do they have to have pets why do they have to have pets man oh shit I'm running on bandages as well bloody hell man that took so fucking long one bloody quest took so long now oh my god don't like it it feels horrible. I don't like sticking around, sticking around in one place, man. I mean, bloody hell, it feels like... It feels like only yesterday, because it was yesterday. We saw a goddamn ally over there, man. 
He was trying to kill us. All right, here we go. Another bloody quest to kill orange mobs. Doesn't feel good at all, man. Not even a tiny bit. Oh my god, man. Get away from that shroom, Concrest. Concrest, move. Concrest. Concrest is dead. What are my played time is in this character? Slash played. Two days, 19 hours. Two days and 19 hours? I expected it to be more than that, actually. Feels like it should be at least double that. <laughs> it feels like double that. Starting to keep count early, by the way, now. Five fungal giants we have slain. Zero boglord tendrils have we acquired. Am I killing the wrong mob? I think that that's a very legitimate question to be asking ourselves right now. What are we doing here, man? Whose idea was this? Iron Man challenge? Whose idea was this? What do you mean it was mine? Fuck it. Can I give up now, can we? we come too far. We come too far, man, to give in. Loot. Unidentified bloody plant parts, of course. Okay, if a Boglord Tendril doesn't spawn right now, not spawn, but drop from one of these three mobs that we just killed, I'm uninstalling, wow. Right, that's it, Monday Soling. So yeah, the episode ends right now. Damn it though, seriously man, I've killed like nine of these fucking things now. Where the hell are these goddamn Boglord tendrils? Wow. Alright. We've killed more than 12 of these things. More than 12. I've lost count now. I know it's definitely more than 11. I'm assuming it's more than 12 by now. Oh my god, like... They just don't have any tendrils, man. She's just lying to me about them having tendrils. They do not have Boglord tendrils on their faces, alright? Am I checking the wrong tendril? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Fuck that, man. I'd rather abandon the damn quest. <gasps> oh my god, Boglord tendrils do exist. Okay, they are actually a real item in the game. We only had to kill 17 fucking bug lords to get it. We need four more. So what? How many more do we have to get? He just fucking one shot Conquest, man. See that bitch slap you just give him? How many more then do we need to collect? What? 80 something? Something like that? Maybe 70 something more? And we need to kill 70 more fungal giants to get the four more tendrils. Seems fucking reasonable. Not even salty, man. <laughs> Blizzard. Fix your bloody quests, man. This shit, I remember this shit being hard back in uh, TBC as well. I remember this shit being hard back in TBC. For eight years, this quest has been pissing people off. Yeah, I didn't think you'd have a fucking tendril either. You noblest little shithead. These bloody giants, man. They kick fucking poor little conks ass, man. And that's like the 25th one that I've killed and I've got like two tendrils. One tendril! Oh my god. Okay, I'm serious, man. I'm not gonna show all of these in the, um... In the video, but I'm gonna type right now, actually. I think I've killed about 23 right now. I'm gonna type that in. Every time I kill one, I'm gonna keep on adding under that number so I don't forget. And I just want to, I just want to measure how many fucking of these we need to kill just to complete this quest to collect six tendrils. And bear in mind, it says right here I've collected two Boglore tendrils, right? I already had one in my bag that I saved from earlier, from a, a previous quest chain. I randomly looted one um, because that they're, they're not like unique quest items. They're actually they actually just drop randomly as well, um, even when you don't have the quest. So I've actually only got one drop out of 23 kills. And I'm gonna fucking show this to Blizzard, man. I'm gonna show this to Blizzard. You know what? Fix this shit in Legion and I'll be happy, man. Fix this shit in Legion and I'll be happy. Of course he didn't drop a bloody tendril. And just for the record, actually, it's 24. How long have I been here now? You guys can see from the time in the video. Like, maybe you can skip to the beginning of where I first started killing these. Um, I feel like I've been here for at least an hour already. We said to be here for even longer than that. Let's kill number 47 on these guys, by the way. Just let you know right now. 
We're also out of bandages. We have two left, rather. Oh, God. It's making me just want to wrap up the episode right now. It's making me just want to wrap up the episode right now, man. Christ, this is tedious. 62 kills. Only three drops. Six, just, okay, just take that in for a moment. 62 kills. 62. And y you know what I'm saying? Like, and we've had three drops. You know what the fucked up thing is as well? If you read the goddamn quest description, natural enemies, let's give that a click. Let me see this shit. Like, okay, the bottom half, the bottom half of the quest description. If you were to fight the bog lords for us, we'd be forever in your debt. Bring me their tendrils so I know how many you've killed. I'm gonna bring back six bastard tendrils, and she's gonna be like, oh, you only killed six of them. There it is. One more. One more meaning. At least, like, 17 more fucking kills or something. Jesus Christ. I know a lot of you guys don't want me to give in on this. I don't want to fucking give, on this, uh, give in on this, man. But if this is just Outland... This is uh, this is just Outland, man. It's just Outland. We've got fucking Northrend to go yet. Holy shit, we've got Northrend to go yet. Oh my god, holy shit, finally. Here we are. Literally 80 or more kills later. 85 plus, I want to say. 85 kills or something to get 5 drops there. Oh my god, man. I think that's basically going to be the episode, guys. I got me some fucking patrons to shout out who are golds and who are supporting the videos. And again, I'm sorry, man, about the commentary on this one. I don't feel like I was my hugely motivated self. And it was hard to be, you know? It was hard. Um, I can't be too sorry, because... Hell, I think that most of you guys will understand. Alright, we're going to go over here to investigate the spawning glen. Run around there a little bit. Do that shit, and that should get us the fucking ding. Bam! Easiest ding of me life. Fucking JK, oh my god. Alright, guys. We got a small collection. New patrons over here. We got ourselves. We got ourselves Zul and. Super It's. It's Chi? It's Chi? God damn, man. There's always. A, it feels like there's always one name that I'm just like butchering completely. Let me just double check that. Okay, yeah, that's Super Itzchi and Zul. Thanks all so much, guys, for choosing to support the channel on the Patreon page. But yeah, in all seriousness, everybody supporting on Patreon, appreciate that shit so, so fucking much. Um, helps me keep on doing what I'm doing here on YouTube. Um, and I hope that you guys are enjoying watching it as well. We've got a couple of challenges rolling over now. I think that the chicken to leg challenge might have ended. To your guys' point of view right now. That one's come to a close. Still going along with Iron Man, cut through a challenge rolling. It's nice to have series going, it's nice to have series. We're just going through a damn rough patch right now in Iron Man, oh my god. But yeah, regardless of all of that, thanks for sticking with us guys on this fucking arduous journey. Uh, really, really appreciate it. Have an awesome day now, I'm going to get myself back to Shat to log out there where it's nice and safe and cosy. Um, I'm going to catch all of you guys in just a tad bit later. Whatever man, Umbrofen Buff, that was the name of his buff, did you see that shit? Creative Blizzard. I mean, I think we, I think we found something to finally top Slither Strike. Stand back. I will strike him with a Slither.